Jimmy, I, 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 I don't know what the hell's happened to your people, sure. I, I don't have a damn clue. Because let me let me tell you what the old bastard said. Let me tell you. Shut up, Jimmy. I'm trying to tell you something. I'm trying to tell you what your people are saying. I'm sitting in here earning his damn clothes like I've been doing. For all these years, I've been sitting here earning his damn clothes. And do you know what the old bastard had the nerve to ask me to do? Shut up, Judy. I'm trying to tell you. He said, will you start earning my uh, underwear and socks? He's lost it. Julie, he's lost it. Ain't no way in this big blue and green earth am I going to earn some underwear. He's been down the street talking to Bobby Earl. Cause I know Gladys stupid ass does it for him. For his that sorry piece of a shit man that she's got. But I can tell you what, he better take his damn underwear. Damn it, this hair's getting on my nerves. He better take his underwear, his socks, and whatever the hell else he wants down there to Gladys' house and see if Gladys will do it for him. I've been married to this stupid ass man for 42 years, six months. Nine days, three and a half hours, and I ain't never, never earned his damn underwear or socks. And I'm not starting to date that stupid fat. You better come get your people. Something's wrong with him. I'm taking him to the doctor tomorrow because that old fool done got senile. Ask me to do some shit like that.